Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Sea Turtle Mindset. I'm so excited right now. Why? Because you just purchased Sea Turtle Mindset. This is the first introductory video for Sea Turtle Mindset. So what I'm going to do is I'm really going to talk to you about what you expect on the next videos. See, one of the things, I read a lot of books, and one of the things that I wanted to do all the time was speak to the author. You know, sometimes these authors are famous, very famous, cost thousands of dollars just to have a meeting with them, or some of these authors, God bless their soul, are dead. I'm just gonna keep it real, but I'm alive. So what I'm doing and what I wanna do with my readers is go more deeper within the chapter and just really explain what more what my motives was, what I'm really trying to portray. Also, I would love to hear your wisdom, you know? Because here's the thing. I wrote my the book in a particular way um, during a time of my life where I was really self-developing and just learning more and more and more and just diving deep within these books of pages. It's a sea of pages of books. I love it. And the thing is this. Every time I read my book again, I learned something different. I, I caught a new message, even, even as the author himself. So please, I ask you, this is, this is a call to action for my readers. Please spread your wisdom. If you read something that resonates with you, spread it to the world because your perspective and my perspective are completely different perspectives. See, your outcome of the book is completely different from mine. So the reason why I'm doing this video is because of this. See, once the mind expands, it cannot contract, okay? When the mind expands with an idea, it cannot contract back to its original form. So I just want to help you expand that mind even more. You know, sometimes I wrote something in the book that I really wanted to say in this way, but the videos in every chapter, so you're going to see this in every chapter. So this is the introduction. This is the first video on the first, I don't know what page I'm placing it on, but it's the first video. So I wanted to interact with the book. I wanted the book to have a different experience. See, sometimes I pick up a book, I read it, put it down. But there are other books that have audios and I listen to it. So now I have this YouTube that I want to create videos based on the Sea Turtle Mindset um, book and also more and just dive deeper into the concept of the book. Now, I'm just excited. Why? Because I want to help spread the wisdom and I really want to help you ignite that journey of self-discovery, which everybody has their own journey of self-discovery. So um, whatever pace you're going, remember this, okay? The Sea Turtle swims and every thrust of his flippers gets them further see in the beginning when they hatch they go from the egg nest to the ocean but not all sea turtle hatchlings make it to adulthood my goal is to help you go from a hatchling to a fully grown sea turtle and throughout the youtube videos i'm going to use these analogies such as um Octopus, you'll see later on how it helps you understand more how to focus on things. So I'm just excited. I wanted to make this introduction video just because I just wanted to speak to you guys, really get to know me as the author and really get to know my motives, what my mission is. See, my mission is this, to spread the wisdom and help others ignite the journey of self-discovery. You see, along my journey through around the world, I've been learning these different experiences. I've been... Um, immersing myself in different cultures, dealing with all walks of life, and it's amazing. I'm telling you, everyone you encounter with has something to teach, no matter what age. There's something beautiful in them, and I just wanna learn from everyone, so I also wanna learn from you. So when you see this video, post, leave a comment, say something, spread your wisdom. Everyone has a story. See, later on, I'm also going to help others create their own books because never in a million years did I think I was going to be an author. Never. See, I went to school for civil engineering in Spanish. I follow the same process as everyone. Go to school so I can get good 
get good grades so you can get a good job. I, I listen to my mom, listen to my dad, listen to my grandma, especially my grandma. Um, and I went to college. I went to the University of Rhode Island for civil engineering in Spanish. And I was inspired by my last year of college, which was the assignment was this. Write a short story, five pages. And I started writing like, like any other college student, right? They wait until the last minute. So I waited the day before to start writing it. And when I wrote it, I wrote more than I needed to write. And so I sent it to my, um, my, to my teacher, um, and he was like, hey, this might be a good idea to write a book. And I asked, I told him, I said, like, I might want to write a book. He's like, just elaborate. He started helping me. And every time I took a vacation or I traveled to a different part of the country or a different part of the world, I just wrote a little. You see, I started using Hemingway's um, ideology of the, of the well of knowledge. You see, you have a well, and every day you go take out one bucket of knowledge from the well. Boom. Boom. You don't go empty out the well because the next day you're going to be thirsty. So I just started doing that every single day. I just started writing a little bit every single day. And all of a sudden, I had a full 100-page book. And I was like, oh, my goodness. I got to spread the wisdom. And the cool thing about the 21st century right now, we have YouTube. And YouTube, you can distribute more knowledge through visual, right? So I wanted to do this so that I can help the reader really dive into my head and really understand where I'm coming from. So the next step is subscribe. I don't know where it is. Subscribe so that every time I post something new, you can dive into it. See, besides the book's content, I'm also going to have motivational content, how to change your mindset so you can change your life. So not only did you already do the first initial step to buy the book, which I'm proud and I'm so honored. I'm really, really honored. Thank you so much because... I value your time and I value mine and the time it took me to write this amazing content. I would love for you to learn and spread and even learn more and teach. See, there's one thing about learning something, practicing it, and then teaching it. I think that's our goal. I think that's what we're supposed to do. I think we're supposed to learn something, use it in our life, and then teach it. That's the wisdom. That's the that's the that's the that's that's how wisdom is acquired. Okay? So I'm always I'm always saying this, knowledge is potential power, but wisdom is actual power. So, can't wait to see you on the next video. Definitely dive deep. And by the way, yes, the book does start at chapter 11. Why? Because I don't like to be like the average booksellers. I don't like to be average. So, can't wait to see you on the next video. Definitely dive deep.